okay i i don't want you to do mvs let me be clear don't do mvs do anything instead that would be better let me give reasons why you should not do mvs so 10th after 10th you'll do your inter by pc that is and need ug are by please last year 25 lakh students applied see the competition and so out of 720 to 720 some 60 or 70 plus members got it so see the competition okay after you are selected then you do mbbs for 4.5 years and then internship one year if you are government colleges you will get paid and if you are private you will not get paid here also and then need pg need pg here three years so five so six years plus three years six plus three and you don't do directly here you will get one lt here you will get another lt so nine ten eleven years And then in PG, you, uh, these are end branches. Matlab after, after completing this PG, you can directly start practicing or you can do super specialties. But for this, for medicine and surgery, you have to have to do super specialties. So again, three years plus one more year LT. Because seats are less. See, they increase the UG seats and they don't increase PG and super specialty seats. What is the use? Like here thousands of the seats, like 10,000 seats will be there. Here thousand will be there. Here hard, like 10, 20s, hundreds will be there. Here only like single digit colleges will be there. See many UG seats, uh, all government colleges can have UG seats, but they don't have the PG seats. Like what is the use? And all these are like ENT, Ophthal, Peach, Palmo, Radio. You can start practicing even after doing PG, but they require a super specialty. And an MBBS graduate in Telangana gets around 45 to 50K. Okay, mostly 45. And in government setup, this is. And in uh, for PG, you'll get around 50, 55. Okay, after completion, you may get around 1. Around 1. After completion of PG, after completion of 11 years, after completion of 11 years, you will get around 1. See, what I am trying to say is, if you do BTEC, 4 years you will be done, 4 years you will be done, and you, you will be saving here 1 more year, and here 2 years, and this 3 years, and this 1 year. Like, you will be saving around 5 years. If two years were gone, uh, you got job directly. Even if you start with 40k, after five years, won't you start around one? My friends don't get this math. I don't know why. So the basic concept is this. Oh, they say doctors get paid very well in private hospitals. No, they get around only this much. And if you, and plus stress, unlimited stress. If you think you are the hero of your exams, oh, I will prepare very well and prepare. No. NMB is the hero. If he want to conduct exam, he will conduct. If he want to postpone one day before the exam, he will postpone. You have to bear your stress. He is not responsible for your stress. And no therapy will be given. You should, could handle karo. Because you are doctors and you should do it. That's what NMB thinks of you. And if you want to set up a hospital, so after this, oh, super specialty is again 3 years. So, 11 plus 3, 14 plus 1, 15 years, congratulations. After completion of uh, your BIPC or NEET UG, you will end up with super specialty after 15 years. And if you want to build your own hospital, land cost, hospital building setup, and up to 5 years, you will anyway not have that much patient load. You will be settled only after like not 5 years, okay, 3 years. 
3 to 5. Let's say 3 to 5. You will be uh, so around 20 years. This many years will this many years it takes to get settled for a doctor. Even if you start content creator, you will be in greater position within 5 years. Believe me. Or 10 years, not 20 years. Yeah. 20 years is too much. 15 years is also too much. 10? Okay. 11. So, better don't become a doctor. Don't choose to become a doctor. Coming to the fee, MBBS, if you do in government, there will be no fee. And in private, it is around 60K. Where should I write? Uh, let here. In, in private, it is 60K college fee. Uh, hostel, you may choose to stay in hostel or outside, but it will be above 1 lakh for sure. But most of the colleges in Telangana are... Uh, are countryside so you you don't find any stay so you have to stay in hostel which is which will be above one lakh and coming to the pg for government college for government okay but for private it a college fee will be around five lakhs plus hostel mandatory hostel is mandatory so it will be again above one lakh with no stipend no salary will be given and here also no salary will be given during internship so based on these calculations choose wisely